Okay, guys, so this story um came about to me, and it says, Woman lease room on Airbnb. Tenant refuses to leave the house. Now, the thing is, I don't know how long she leased the um room out to the tenant, but let me tell you what the rules are with the Airbnb. If a person has been staying there for 30 or more days, they're considered a tenant. So, this lady must have leased the room out on Airbnb. This tenant must have been there for that 30 days or more. And that's why she has rights now as a tenant. She doesn't have to leave the house. Like, the lady has to go through all the processes to get this lady out but you know it's good that she's documenting everything and how the uh lady is acting because she can also um show that to the uh the judge and show it to her lawyer because i know she has a lawyer here but you know that's pretty much what happened with this situation but let's hear um her talk about it Okay, so I can't even talk right now. I'm so pissed off. I, I didn't even know this shit could happen, but this shit is real. This shit is really going on. Goddamn, I found myself trying to find a way to goddamn pay off my mortgage a little better, a little quicker, or whatever. So I put this this ad out or whatever saying I was looking for someone to sub lease one of the rooms in my house or whatever. It was going to be a, supposed to be like this real smooth transaction or whatever. I was, went on vacation or whatever. The person was supposed to be gone three days prior to my return. <clears throat> so I'm talking to my housekeeper or whatever, X, Y, Z. Okay, so um, how long was your vacation? Because if you rented this out, Y'all, excuse me in the background. I'm about to eat me some glory greens. Um, <clears throat> I just had some uh, egg salad, half of an egg salad sandwich. But yeah, the thing is, um, how long was your vacation? Because if you went on vacation for a minute and this tenant, which it sounds like was living there, you know, now they have rights. Yeah, now they have rights because. The, the, that's how I see it when I looked it up because I went to research it, it said if somebody has been living it doesn't matter whether you lease it out or what if somebody has been living there more than 30 days or more they're considered a tenant now so you must have went on vacation for a minute I'm guessing because that's what that's what it's saying but yeah these people you got to be really careful when you rent stuff out to people. That's why I never did the renting and stuff. Like, um, that's why I never dealt with um, Airbnb and, like, trying to rent out um, a room or something like that. I would never do that because they have rights. And if, man, if something messes up, look what this lady is going through right now. She's like, yo, that person is still here in your house. You mean they're still in my house? It's supposed to be gone. So when I get back and touch down in the city, this is still here in my fucking house, okay? Refusing to leave. So I don't know what to do. I'm used to this shit. So I go down and I do up. There you go, y'all. And it's crazy because the lady has an attitude with this um with this woman. And I'm just like, why you have an attitude with her when you're supposed to be out of her house? And now you're talking about, I ain't going nowhere. I ain't going nowhere. Like, why would you do this? It's crazy because this is a black lady. You know what I'm saying? And um, you shouldn't be doing this. Why would you do that? I would just be like, um... You know, if you're having trouble, I'm sure you could have talked to the lady. And by like, look, I'm having a little bit of trouble. You know, um, I probably need a. Can I get at least two more days here, and I'll pay you for it. But that lady took it upon herself to be like, I ain't paying nothing. I'm gonna stay here. You know, I'm a, I'm a act the fool. I'm gonna be disrespectful. Like, why, why are you doing all this, being disrespectful? 
Like, you should have left that lady's house like you were supposed to, but, you know, you can tell this woman ain't got nowhere to say. Her life is in shambles, and she wants to try to um, eat off of somebody else's plate. Straight to the kitchen. I ain't going nowhere. So deal with it. Because I want you to get out. You you had your time. I rented it out to you to help you out. This is like people rent places out, not just for the money, but so people have a place to stay. If we didn't have no, if we didn't have people renting out houses and you know building houses and stuff like that, where do you all think we would be living? We wouldn't have no place to live because you know um, houses break down. And houses need to be repaired. They need to have inspections again. You know, um, it's just like if you get a house and it start falling apart and stuff. You know, the inspector going to come over there and be like, hold up. You got to get this fixed. Just like if you live in an apartment, hold on. You got to get this fixed. You can't have these people living like that. You have to get this fixed. They can get it condemned and get it shut down. So, your house is not going to be, you have to, you have to, uh, pre- Re- do repairs on your house all the time to keep it up to shape. Everybody knows that. You just can't stay in the house and it just be falling apart. You already know the inspector will come in. But this is crazy. Like, lady, how are you sitting here disrespecting this lady like this? You're living in her place. She gave you a place to stay, thinking that you were going to be a good person. And then you sitting around there, you know, um, this is crazy. This is crazy, and people are actually doing this. That's why you have to be very careful when you do Airbnbs. Cause my husband's friend had um a situation like that happen to her. I think the person was renting out the place while um they were renting it or something to get money. But yeah, you have to really watch the people and know the people that you're renting to. And this is wrong for this lady to do. But you know, God see uh, ugly, and she'll get hers in due time. But you don't do people like that. This is wrong. This is wrong. This lady knows she's wrong. Joe Dorf, this is my house. How about you get the f- out of my house? How about that's what you do? How about you get the f- out of my house? How about you get the f- out of my house? How about you get... <sighs> Yo. Yo, I don't see how she did it. I don't see how that lady did it. I hope... Let me see what these comments are saying. Your tenant just saw the next flick special. Yeah, you should watch Worst Tenant Ever. You're going to learn a <clears throat> thing or two. Also, this is horrible. I hope you deal with it again. Watch the special. Trust me. So, they said that it's a special on next week, which I'm about to go over there. Worst Tenant Ever. And um, I guess it's going to show stories about tenants that didn't leave and things like that it says um it varies state by state when tenants rights kick in oh okay so i don't know what state this was in but most of the time 30 days after 30 days or what have you you know people can um say that they're attending i know in maryland it's six months Uh, in my state, for example, it's after occupying a rental for more than two weeks in a six-month period, which is why if you have an Airbnb, I wouldn't allow 
someone to rent it for more than a week or so. If she, if she's been there under the allotted time, wait for her to leave and change the locks. Well, she said she wasn't leaving. That's the thing. Homegirl said she wasn't leaving. Just put a brick wall in front of her door. <laughs> Remove all the toilets and pool ladders. Sims style. <laughs> yeah, put a new lock on the bathroom door and any other doors in the house. Once she's trapped, she will eventually leave. Not with some people, honey. Some people don't have... She probably don't have nowhere to go. She's going to be claiming the inheritance next. Um, Get your family, friends, or other people you can trust not to rat in a new lock kit. Then remove her kicking and screaming if you have to. I doubt she'll take it to court. Something I'll do in this situation. Agree. She wouldn't take it to court. She would just move. On to the next victim. Yeah, you had to take these people to court. But they said. They said that's a process. Like who wants to go through all that process? Like who wants to have to carry the, this person to court? Go through the long legal processes. No, I just want this person out of my house. And that's what I'm talking about. Like you have these squatter rights. How does, how does a squatter have a right to something that they don't own? That's ridiculous. How 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 can somebody come in your house and it's meant people have been people have went on vacation, guys, and came back. There was just a recent story. The lady came back and it was a black guy and his white girlfriend laying in her bed. And she was like, get out of my house. Like, it couldn't have been me because if I was registered, I would have shot both of them. I, I would have been, because I would have been startled at people in my house, and I would have just start capping off. You know, you can't just, you just can't be in people's houses like this. And these squatter rights, they're going to start to get people really, you're going to start to see people falling victim, you know, getting hurt by these squatter rights. Because everybody ain't going to be really pleased and blessed with somebody squatting in their house like that. So they need to get rid of these squatter rights. These people need to get jobs and, and find a place to live and stop being bums. Because this is a bummy situation. This lady should not have to put up. She this lady tried to help her out and now she's acting like a bum. She's acting like a a, a dusty uh a dustina is what they call them. She's acting real dusty right now. So, this whole situation, I mean, I don't get it, y'all. But, you know what? I will see you guys later. Please like and subscribe to my channel. Also, hit the bell notification so you can know each and every time I upload a video. And also, put some comments down below how y'all feel about this. Do you feel like um, the, lady, the lady made a mistake in... Um, rent her home out to um this lady and do you think the lady is being really disrespectful and how do you think she should go about doing this because she already told you it's a long process what do you guys what do you guys think that um you know she can do you know what i'm saying to uh to get the to get this process going so she can get that lady out the house you know, I'll see you guys later in another one. Peace.